And we'll get into the highlights immediately. How about Landon Jordan on the keeper, first and goal. He makes the house call this one 14 to nothing at this point for Ottawa Glandorf. Then OG pinned back deep in their own territory. I mean deep. And St. Mary's coming up with the safety. So 14 to two, a score you don't see very often in football. How about a different view of this touchdown from our broadcast team being creative and Ottawa Glandorf doing what works really well. Ian Finbert bulldozing his way into the end zone, 21 to two. St. Mary's not going away. Gavin Reinecke runs, throws. Tanner Howell open down the sideline. Then he crosses over. He's trying to get to that corner. Get to that pylon. Can he get there? Dives at the end. Got it. Touchdown, St. Mary's. Get that young man some oxygen as well as the six points. St. Mary's trying to keep pace. Too much OG in this one, though. Jordan on the keeper, giving OG the 28 to 9 lead at the half. And they pick up the win, 35 to 16. Again, this one on at 1030 over on WOSN. Tomorrow morning, it'll be on right here on WTLW. After the game, Evan caught up with Evan Skilder, caught up with OG head coach Ken Schreiner. Congratulations on the win. I want to talk to you a little bit about the uh, the hot start you guys had. 28 points in the first half. What contributed to that hot start? You know, our kids have been resilient. You know, we didn't perform well in our first two games, especially coming out of the, the locker room to start the game. And, you know, our kids came out and just executed a great game plan. I think our, our offensive coaches did a great job of preparing our guys and our defensive coaches did a great job of, you know, getting our guys in the right position. And some of our adjustments were phenomenal tonight. Excellent. Now, I know this is a big win for you guys. What does it mean for you moving forward, back-to-back -back nights, uh, huge weeks? Uh, how are you guys looking going forward? One week at a time. You know, you've heard the old coach speak. We're not going to talk about anything else. It's a, it's a victory to enjoy. I think, a, you know, great homecoming crowd. I'm proud of our kids for going out and performing well. You know, great student section, great fan support, and, you know, hopefully we can build on that and move on from here. We know we got a big one coming next week.